Yeah, some news this morning about uh, someone we know pretty well on the show. Jimmy Dunn abruptly resigning from the PGA Tour board yesterday with a letter that expressed frustration at the lack of progress that was being made and uh, that no longer included his input. Dunn was one of the architects behind the PGA Tour's surprise reversal to strike a deal with the Saudi backers of Live Golf. Dunn pointed out that players now outnumber independent directors on the board and said that his vote and his role there is what he called utterly superfluous. Um, there has not been progress made on that uh, deal that was put out. He also said, though, that along with the lawsuits being dismissed, that original agreement with the PIF, it also didn't contain an exclusivity clause. And that's what allowed the investment that came earlier last year from Strategic Sports Group uh, to be made into the PGA, too. I think they were looking at other options, trying to find other investors who might come in on this. That deal originally, the PIF deal, was supposed to be right. resolved by the end of last year, and it has not. It's weird. It's kind of fractured. And, and you can watch both now. The other weekend, there's a PGA event, not this last one, I think it was the week before. And I know most of the golfers, but I didn't really know the top four or five golfers on, on the PGA Tour. Over on the Live Golf Tour, which was on a different channel, where it was like watching a Ryder Cup or a, a major. They were all there, you know, the, the guys that, yep. that, that you see on the leaderboard of the major tournaments. And they're all on, like, teams. And so in addition to the individual scores, it's like, the, it's weird. It was, and do you like that better? Is that what you're trying to say? I just am saying that I was drawn to watching the, the, big, the big names because the other, right. the other uh, event... I had not heard of, like, the top five. They were really good, the top five guys. And it was a great ending the way I ended up back on the PGA. But, no, I'm not saying I'm watching them. I just, they have some great players that definitely are on live. And, uh, you know, we're still available for a, a some type of venture, I think, a business news Rory venture. Rory McIlroy quit the PGA board. Aren't you, Sorkin? Three, 300 is your price? For I, I don't have a price. It's priceless.